So in this video, we'll learn the difference between a data lake and a data warehouse. So let's start with a data lake. Now in a data lake, the data is stored in draw format and in different file formats like Excel, PDF, CSV. So basically, the main purpose of a data lake is to store data. So whatever data that you can get in your hands, you store it in a data lake. So it might be financial data or customer data or anything. Now one nice analogy for data lake is bucket. The way you can store anything in a bucket, you can store any file format, any data in a data lake. So bucket is a similar analogy to a data lake. Now one real life example of data lake. Let's say you have a restaurant. So in the restaurant, you produce lots of data. Let's say you have finance data, which is in CSV format. You have customer data, which is an Excel format. And you have vendor data, which is in PDF format. And you put all these data in an S3 bucket. So this is an example of a data leak. Now let's move to data warehouse. Now the primary difference between data leak and data warehouse that in a data warehouse, the data is stored in an ordered and structured format. You can't store random and raw data in a data warehouse. And one of the major purpose of a data warehouse is to analyze the data. So you can compare a data warehouse to a bookshelf where the books are stored in an ordered format. This is a similar analogy to a data warehouse. Now, a real life example of a data warehouse. Now we can go back to the example of a restaurant. Now let's say you want to analyze your customer data to identify the repeat customer. So in that case, you store the customer data in an SQL database and you analyze this data to find out which are the repeat customer and which are the high value customer. In that case, you're storing the data in a SQL DB and you are trying to analyze that in a structured format. So this is an example of data warehouse.